wonder what could happen under under an umbrella tree. Sunny days of thunder, your friends are waiting under under the umbrella tree. So come on, everybody, see you up at Holly's. There's no better place to be. In your imagination, you'll find an invitation under the umbrella tree. Ugly Duckling lived happily ever after. The end. Huh. So the Ugly Duckling wasn't really a duck after all. That's right. She grew up to be a beautiful swan. Oh, I wonder what I'll grow up to be. A big gopher. <laughs> I think I'll grow up to be a beautiful swan, too. Well, you might find that a bit difficult, Jacob. Oh, all right. <laughs> I'll settle for being a beautiful blue jay instead. Good idea. Yeah. But if you want to grow, you should all get a good night's sleep. Time for bed. Well, okay with me. Oh, oh, I'm tired. Mm, yeah, me too. Oh, me three. <laughs> I hope I can sleep tonight. Oh, I'm sure you'll be fine, Gloria. Yeah, please sleep tonight, Gloria. You woke me up twice last night. I'll try, Iggy, but I'm just not sleeping very well lately. Good night. Well, good night. Good night, night. Gloria. Well, I'm off to my birdhouse on the deck. Okay, here we go. <laughs> oh, it tickles. <laughs> night, good night, Jake. Jacob. And I can't wait to get under the covers. Night, night. Good night, Iggy. Good night, Iggy. Good night, Holly. Good night, Gloria. You snuggle in and get a good sleep. I'll try. Poor Gloria. I think she was awake all last night. Good night, Jacob. Good night, Iggy. I can't sleep. Oh, dear. It's just like last night and the night before. I toss and I turn, but I can't seem to fall asleep. Iggy's asleep already. He's the best sleeper that I know. Maybe he can tell me how to fall asleep. Iggy. 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 What? Are you awake? Well, either that or I'm having a nightmare. Gloria, what's the matter? I can't sleep. Oh, not again. Iggy, you're a great sleeper. What can I do to fall asleep? Well, Gloria, sometimes if I can't fall asleep right away, I, um, I have a piece of cheese. That might help. Cheese? Cheese. Sure, I, I think it helps you to relax. I even keep some right down there below my bed. Huh. Have a piece. Here's a piece. Huh. Does this really work, Iggy? Sure, Gloria. You'll be asleep in no time. Oh, I hope so. I'm so tired. It's really nice of you to help me out like this, Iggy. Iggy? I guess cheese does work for lizards. Well, I'll climb back in bed and see what it does for gophers. Oh, I'm still awake. I can't sleep. I wonder if Jacob could help me. Jacob? Jacob? Jacob! What? 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 Gloria? Hi, Jacob. Were you asleep? Well, yeah, until the earthquake. Oh, sorry. Um, that was me. Huh? Oh. Well, what's wrong, Gloria? Oh, Jacob, I can't sleep. Uh. Iggy told me to eat cheese, but that only works for him. What do you do to fall asleep? To fall asleep? Well, sometimes if I can't get to sleep right away, I do a few exercises. You mean like stretches and running on the spot? No, more like relaxing exercises. I try to tell my body to go to sleep one part at a time. Does it work? Yeah, sure, I'll show you. First I say to my feet, feet, you are very tired, relax. And I let my feet go all loose and sleepy. And then I say, wings, you are very tired. Relax. And I let my wings feel all loose and sleepy. And then I say, head, you are very tired. Relax. And I let my head feel all loose and sleepy. Wow. 
Jacob, that sounds great. I'm going to go right back to bed and try it. Thanks, Jacob. I... Oh, Jacob? Well, it sure worked for Jacob. Dreamland, here I come. Arms, you are very tired. Relax. Yes, you are so tired. Relax, I said. Feet, go back to sleep. No, you can't have a drink of water. I said relax. No, oh, this is not working for me at all. I have to get some sleep. What's wrong with me? Will I ever sleep again? Maybe Holly can help me. She's my last hope. Holly. 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 <gasps> Gloria. Hi, Holly. Are you all right? Holly, I can't sleep. Oh, Gloria, that's too bad. I know. I tried Iggy's cheese, and I tried Jacob's relaxing exercises, and now they're sound asleep and I'm still wide awake. Oh, I'm sorry, Gloria. But you know, I'm sure if you climbed into bed and lay down and closed your little eyes, sleep would come. I've tried and tried, Holly. Oh, what if I never fall asleep again? Oh, no, Gloria, you will. But there must be something keeping you awake. You think so? Are you afraid of the dark? No, I like the dark. Well, at least at night when I'm sleeping. Hmm. Well, do you think maybe the cars in the street are making too much noise and keeping you awake? I don't think so. I can't really hear them when I'm down in my burrow. Well, this is a mystery, Gloria. You certainly look tired enough to sleep. I know. Oh, I'm tired all right. Oh, Gloria. Why don't you try putting your little head down here and we'll see if a lullaby will help. Sleep, little friend. See you again. When all the stars disappear. Sleep, little friend. And until then, you know I'll always be near. Sleep, my best friend, see you again when all the stars disappear. Until then, you know that I'll always be near. Oh, that's a lovely song, Holly. But I'm still awake. Holly? Huh. The lullaby put her right to sleep. Oh, why am, am I the only one left in the house that's still awake? Oh, I better get back to my burrow and try one more time. Ah, oh, what a great morning. There's nothing like a good night's sleep to get me ready for another day of fun and adventure. A one, two, three, four, one. Good two. morning, Iggy. Good morning, Holly. Did you sleep well? Like a rock. Hi, gang. It's another beautiful day outside. Good morning, Jacob. <laughs> Has anyone seen Gloria yet? Hmm. Hello. Gloria, you look terrible. Ooh, you look like you need sleep, Gloria. I know, Jacob. I've been trying all night. Nothing works. I just can't sleep. Oh, Gloria, now try not to get upset. I'm sure sleep will come. Yeah, sometimes I have trouble getting to sleep. You do, Jacob? Uh-huh. Once I remember, I lay awake for five whole minutes before I finally fell asleep. Five minutes? Jacob, I didn't sleep all night. Well, it seemed like all night to me. Oh, you're no help at all. <laughs> Ooh, it's not our fault that Gloria can't sleep. I know, Iggy, and Gloria knows too. It's just that she's very upset from not having slept. She's so tired. Let's go and get breakfast started. Oh, breakfast. Right. <laughs> 
Well, if I can't sleep, I guess I might as well get up. The toast is down. Yeah, I put some cereal in Gloria's bowl. Uh, do you think Gloria will ever sleep again, Holly? Oh, yes, she will, Jacob. Everyone needs sleep. When she gets tired enough, she'll sleep. Maybe she's scared of the dark. Well, she says she's not, Iggy. Well, maybe her bed's too lumpy. Yeah. She's been sleeping in the same bed for a long time, and it's never been a problem. Then why can't she sleep? Yeah. I wish I knew. I'm going to take some cereal to her. Hmm. Gloria? Gloria, I have your breakfast. Hey, what's that noise? I'd know that sound anywhere. Gloria is snoring. I can't see her anywhere. Well, the snoring's coming from over by the bookcase. Look, she's asleep in my bed. Shh, just let her rest for a while. She's so tired. Ouch! Oh, what happened? Oh, Gloria, are you all right? Oh, I think so. What happened? You fell asleep in my bed, Gloria. Until you rolled over and fell out. You mean I actually fell asleep? I think your problems are over, Gloria. Oh, great. I'm going to go right back to sleep in my bed. Excuse me. Well, I'm glad that problem is solved. I hope you're right, but she still hasn't slept in the burrow. Wow. <laughs> Shh. Play quietly so that Gloria can sleep. Oh, oh, yeah. Okay, our tower's almost finished, Jake. Yeah, it's a good one, Egg. Yeah. I can't oh. sleep! Oh. Gloria, we oh. thought you were asleep. Gloria, you fell asleep on Iggy's bed. I know, but now I just toss and turn and I can't sleep. Oh. Well, then it must be your burrow. My burrow? Mm-hmm. You can fall asleep all right outside the burrow, but not inside. Yeah, something inside your burrow is keeping you awake. Uh -huh. But what, Holly? Let's find out. Yeah. Here we are inside your burrow, Gloria. Uh -huh. Now, what is it that's keeping you awake? If I knew that, Jacob, I wouldn't need your help. Oh, right. <laughs> I knew that. Uh, maybe there's something hiding under your bed, Gloria. Like what? A monster. A ghost? You're right. We are? Monsters and ghosts. Monsters and ghosts? Yeah, it's my Monsters and Ghosts sticker book. I always wondered what happened to that. <laughs> oh, that's good. But I don't think that's what's keeping you awake. What are you doing, Jacob? Just checking for potato chips. In the bed? Well, once I spilled potato chips on my bed, and I couldn't sleep because of the crunching noise every time I turned over. Well, there aren't any chips in my bed, Jacob. It's a great little bed, see? How's it going down there? Did you find anything? Nothing yet, Holly. The bed seems fine. I love this little bed. It sure is. Sure is what, Jacob? Little. Look, your feet are hanging over the end. Yeah, and your head doesn't have much room either. Wait. Maybe that's it. What do you mean, Holly? Gloria, maybe you're having trouble getting to sleep because you've grown too big for your bed. But I've slept in this bed for years. And you've been growing for years. You can't sleep with your feet hanging out. And your head all scrunched. Oh, what am I going to do? Get a bigger bed. There. Gloria's new bed is inside and set up. And we can give her old bed away to someone else who needs it. Someone smaller than Gloria. I wonder why Gloria never noticed that her bed was too small. Oh, I think it's easy to forget that you're growing all the time. Well, I sure hope Gloria can sleep in her new bed. Hey, let's ask her how she likes it. Yeah. Gloria, 